Hey everyone, LP here, and I uh, wanted to take a moment to talk to you about something that uh, no one else is talking about, and that is the fact that as the days go on, the days are getting shorter, and your time in darkness is increasing, and that means you're going to need a flashlight. Now with my EDC, I have a couple of different ones that I like, but I tell you what, I've just been given the opportunity to uh, use, and now it's mine, incorporated into my EDC kit. And I wanted to share it with you. And the only way I can do that, because it's, it's, it's sunlight outside, so you never see it. Hey, car. And, um, yeah, let's go to the table. Go! So, generally speaking, my favorite flashlight is actually this uh, Coast HX5. It's a great little flashlight. It fits in my pocket. Uh, it's an, it's, 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 ah, it does a lot of good things, but it doesn't do the things that I want it to do. Then I actually tried to carry this. This is a uh, this is a Netcore P20iX, which is a, is an excellent flashlight, but it's just this huge, beefy thing. So we're not doing that anymore. No more EDC. No more EDC this big. Let's go ahead and talk about the newest. Uh, uh, I'm so impressed with this flashlight, guys. This is the Olight Arcfield Pro. Class 3 RWCW flashlight with racing stripes. Guys, there's actually a story behind this that I'm going to be happy to tell you that I had to dig up because the company that I was working with didn't even know. Now, if you didn't know this, this is actually a Black Friday deal, but we'll, we'll, we'll figure that out when it comes. I'll, I'll, I'll leave that information for the end of the video. This is an unbelievable change to my EDC. Now, the key features, the key features. First of all, I guess let's open it up. Let's let's see what's inside the box. Well, it's got a nice little pull tab on it. I like that. It, well, there we go. All right, so there's our little box. Let's go ahead and set that to the side. Um, where we go? This product's... This ships in lockout mode. Before first use, press and hold the button about one second and the flashlight turns on and the flashlight will be unlocked. So it, it's in a lock mode so that you uh, it doesn't burn the battery down to nothing. All right, whoa, stuff's coming out. Oh, it, oh, I like that. I'm gonna show you guys that in a second. That's gonna blow your mind. So we're gonna set that to the side. We got our standard tri-fold multi-language how to do stuff. Yeah, nobody reads that crap. Oh, a user's manual. What is this? Oh, look at that, look at that. All right, push, the, oh, oh, okay, okay. Um, this could be useful. This could be useful. <gasps> oh, there, there, there we go. Oh, okay, so we may talk about this later, but if not, it looks like a pretty useful manual. Uh, we're going to set all this stuff to the side, and we're going to talk about the flashimum lightimum. All right, so I already like it. <coughs> um, uh, truth be told, I've already taken it out, already charged it up, already played with it a little bit, but this is an awesome little flashlight why uh it has three in one functionality uh it's the it's about the same size as my other clip light but it's not it's it's not bigger than the ginormous and huge weight difference huge weight difference this thing is extremely light um so what do we got here um you've basically three in one functionality it's got three different three different light sources uh, we've got our little belt clip right here which can both by the way can go both ways no pun intended so you can clip it like that or you can clip it like that pretty freaking smart if i say so myself like i said extremely light for what it does uh what do we got here um it's uh you know it's it's got a, a very high uv intensity uh, it's convenient to operate because all the buttons are like right here, like power on, power off, and uh, what I, my multi-selector switch. Kind of like, it's almost, it, it's very reminiscent of uh, one pew, multiple pew pews. Very, very, very uh, easy to use in my brain. Okay, uh, and then uh, it also has a battery level indicator, which we'll turn on here in a second, uh, so you can see this. Now, here's the thing. Um, you know, this, this is what we're calling the versatile three-in-one EDC rechargeable flashlight. Why? Because it fits right in your pocket. People are like, well, I don't need a flashlight. Well, if you haven't figured it out, we've done a time change and um, uh, we have less light to play with during the day. So having a handy flashlight is going to be handy. All right, let's see here. So um, 
basically the Arcfield uh, Pro, co you know, combines white light, UV light, and green beam in a single flashlight. You think that's not useful? You are wrong. You are incorrect today. So uh, it's very compact in size. It's easy to operate. Uh, it holds. It's flat on its side. It's kind of sleek, you know. Got a little warning there for the laser. Uh, but it, uh, it, it really fits in the hand very well. It's not too big, and it's not too small. It's just right. Uh, and the thing is, is you can switch the lights very, pretty effortlessly. It's pretty easy to do. We're going to fire the sucker up in a, in a, in a second, you know. Um, but uh, like I said, it has a five-level battery indicator. I think I'll throw, a, I'll throw something up on the screen someplace uh, when I make this video so you guys can actually see the, what the indicator means. Uh, I found it to be very informative because most of the time you're like, oh, okay, whatever, you know. Uh, but you don't really know what it is. Um, and, um, you know, the, <laughs> so the... Arcfield Pro by Olight. Uh, this racing stripe actually is a design that was given uh, to the company by what they call an O-Fan. Uh, uh, it's like a fan of their flashlights. They have their own fan base, I guess. Uh, and uh, it's kind of cool, but uh, his name is uh, Jerry Fistouche, and he made this for the company to use as a Vroom racing stripe. Let's see, does it work? Vroom. Did it look faster? Vroom. Did it look faster? I think so. Okay, so um, with that said, let's go ahead and start playing with this puppy. Now, how is this guy powered? It's actually a rechargeable 1500 milliamp lithium battery. Let me get that in the frame. I got to keep it in the frame. Lithium battery. Uh, it has a max runtime of 11 days. Not a joke. And believe it or not, this is a 42% increase from older models. So it's pretty awesome. Uh, the UV light, let me flick and we're going to, we're going to, can you see that? The UV light, we're going to flick it to UV light and we're going to turn it on. Oh, there we go. We got, we got our UV light on, and this is under bright light. There's intense lights over the top of my head right now. So this is pretty awesome. Let's see what it does to this. See, oh, look at that. Does that look real? Does that, that's, is that real money or is it? Uh, let's do some real money. Let's do some real money. Um, look, oh, you see the line, guys? Oh, look, you see that line? Oh, look, the UV light's working. It's picking up all sorts of neat little things, little glow-in-the-dark 20s, things like that, but it really picks up that line. This thing has got a serious UV light on it, guys. Um, and then uh, let's turn it off, and then we're going to flip it over to a laser. I flipped it off just by pushing that, that button right there. Uh, we're going to flip it over to the, the laser. Uh, what do we got here? This is a Class 3. Uh, Oh, it's, it's, a, it's a Class 3R laser green light. Uh, you can use it for presentations. Uh, I use it to torture my cat with. But I found Worm himself loves this loves this laser beam more than anything else I've ever played with him before. Um, and uh, believe it or not, the white light can actually work in tandem with the laser to uh, both illuminate as well as target things, if you know what I mean. All right, uh, and uh, then uh, with this UV light, we're going to go back to the UV light because I feel like I didn't tell you enough about it. Uh, this UV light um, has been strengthened. Uh, it's a it's a 900 milliwatt uh, light. It's uh, covering six, 365 nanometers in spectrum, which means it can really find things very quickly, very easily. Uh, in the in the UV spectrum, um, so uh, it's actually super powerful. It's very professional. You could use this on the work site if you needed to. Oh, I just switched right to the laser. Isn't that special? Uh, and you can find those, you know, those invisible things that the naked eyes can't find. You know, like stains. You know, or uh, you know, just things that things that UV light finds, guys, like up on the ceiling, that kind of stuff. You guys know what I'm talking about. All right. So with the white light, let's see. We're going to flip over here to the white light, which is the most common use. The white light, we're going to turn that on. That's the lowest setting. So to give you guys an idea with the white light, uh, we're going to talk about these these in a little bit more detail here in a second. But uh, with the white light, it, it can do up to 1,300 lumens. Um, there we go. And I'm holding it. It's getting brighter. It's getting brighter. And oh my God, I burst into flames. This is what they call moon mode. All right, so it's got three settings. That's 1,300 lumens. That's incredibly bright. I don't even want to show it. I don't even want to point it at you guys. It's so bright. All right, so let me go ahead and turn it off. And what I like about it is it actually remembers where you were. So I had this on 1,300 lumens, and I hit it again. It comes right back. Now, I've had it presets. 
using the hold button. So this is the minimum. This is moonlight. I turn it off and then I turn it back on and then there's moonlight. So you don't have to cycle through all the different types of light that you have. And if you want to turn it up, you just hold it down and then we're going to turn it off and then we're going to turn it back on. And it remembers where you were so that that is pretty awesome sauce. One of the things that I didn't cover was the technical specs. Um, so, uh, you know, I told you that it's a 42% increase on the battery life. Uh, it'll last for 11 days. But if we, if we talk about each one of the selectors, it's really going to depend on what you use this light for the most. Um, if you talk about the UV light, I can show you the UV light. You guys can bear, probably just barely see that. Strobe warning, don't know, nobody have a seizure. Uh, but with the UV light, uh, this will run for 315 minutos, min, minutes, minutos. Uh, so you can, you can use this however long you need to while it's on for 315 minutes. If we switch over to the green laser, that green laser will last for 61 hours. Not a joke. It's pretty cool stuff. Uh, and then if we go to the uh, uh, the white light, and we still have it set at, um, I think it's 1300. We're going to set that. No, it wasn't. There we go. So this is moon. This is the moon light, or moon level, as they call it. Let me. Help you. I think I'm saying that right. It's moon something. It's on the packaging. It's the lowest level. That will uh, that will last you for 264 hours. Um, let's see. Let's turn it off. We're going to turn it off. Let's set it right over here. And I want to show you something. I'm going to have to do like a very quick plug and play reset. Let's do that now. Okay, guys. So what I've done is I've got my little, I don't know if you can see. Uh, just it, the cable won't stretch. There it is. I've taken the charger it, the, that it comes with. This is the charging cable. It's a USB-A to a magnetic charging cable. And I've hooked it up to my extended USB thing. And we'll get that out of the frame here in a second. And then all you have to do to charge this thing, you can set it up on your nightstand every day where you drop all your EDC gear. And then all you have to do is, I'm going to bring this up close. Look at that. Magical. Magical. And uh, you can't see it because it's bright. Let me turn this light off. So you can see right there, it actually has its own little red light right at the tip of this. When this thing's fully charged, it turns green, and you should be able to see it actually. So you just, and then all you do, just not charging. Oh, look, it turned green. Turn green, guys. Char not charging, charging. Not charging, charging. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome technology. Let me turn that light back on. All right, so guys, while that, uh, that, while that charges, I'm going to turn you over here so you can actually see the logo and all that good stuff. There you go. So you're like super impressed with that. All right, guys, so here's the deal. The company sent me this light because I was like, hey, you guys have a pretty cool light. I'm going to make a video for you. And uh, it was like, uh, well, we've got, by the way, Black Friday's coming. So I was like, well, oh, this, could, this could be pretty cool, you know. And um, so... What's basically happening is is uh, they have a Black Friday event. I'll put something on the screen someplace uh, that uh, that starts on November 21st. Uh, and, but they're also going to run it until December 2nd. So there's a lot of opportunities there, you know. So if you want to get your hands on one of these and actually save a significant amount of money, here's what I recommend you do. Click the link below. I'm going to leave it in the, in the description. It's going to take you to an eBay site. This is a legitimate company selling these, these products here in the United States. I was actually referred to this company by the UK company. So this is all completely legitimate, guys. So this is, this is, their, e, this is their US uh, Black Friday event. And they're going to be they're going to be giving you guys a deal on this Arcfield Pro CW with racing strikes, and you're going to be able to save up to 25 percent off of their original price. Now this rate this does normally run 99.99, but uh, with around 25 percent off, that's 74.99. That uh, <laughs> that's that's significant. And by the way, if you buy one of these, uh, you're talking about hundreds of dollars. So. Quality, fits in the pocket, no problem. You can double clip it if you like. You can charge it with this magnetic bad boy thingamabob. You can shoot the UVs. You can shoot the lasers. You can shoot the flashlight. Oh, that's off. And we're going to go brighter and brightest. Oh, we're just going to turn that off. No seizures today, guys. No seizures today. All right, guys. Once again, November 21st, 
Pacific Daylight Time, guys. Pacific Daylight Time. This is going to be a deal. 25% off. It's originally $9.99. It's going to take this device down to $74.99. And guys, when I talk about a quality flashlight, you cannot screw it up. Matter of fact, I want to see if this... Now, I'm looking for... I want to see the uh, the lights. It's charging now, so... I want it. There we go. You see that? Oh, yeah. When you turn it on... Oh, it's like the Matrix. There it is. So I got it charging, right? But cha cha Oh, yeah. I like it. All right. And so you actually know how much power is in this puppy. Come here, you. There we go. Isn't that pretty? All right, guys. That's the last thing I'm going to talk about. I better turn it off before I, like, laser something. Pew! Um, guys, it's a tremendous deal. Take a look at it. Uh, I want to thank um, Olight for sending this to me making this video possible. This is my new EDC pocket light. Not a joke. All right, guys, you know the deal. Until the next time, stay safe, have a great day, and I'll see you when I see you. Bye-bye.